Hello everybody, Justin Green here from Go Green Mobile RV Repair. We're going to talk about the poop chute, septic systems. Um, best way to take care of your septic system. I leave my gray tank open because I have a flush system that I can pump water in when I do my black. So I leave the gray open and when I want to drain my black, close the gray, I turn on this hose, I let it fill up for a good second depending on how much black water I have in the tank at the time. I pull this and I close this again, the black tank, let it fill up water again, and I keep doing that process till it runs clear. Now, let me leave this back open, my wife's using the sink. Now say I have a clog, and I can't get anything to drain out of my black or my gray. We have this apparatus from Camco, I'll have a link in the description. Um, you, you hook it up like so, to go to your black tank, and you hook up your hose here, you close the valve behind it and flush water into the tank that is clogged, and you let it run, until you know you you'll either you'll either hear something push through or you'll see the pressure release or something will change and then you can dump it out and you can keep doing that process until it completely empties out the clog in your black or your gray tank a lot of people get their black tank clogged because they leave it open and the water runs out but all the solids and the paper gets stuck inside either the hoses or inside the tank or you know at the, the valve at the tank and that can cause a lot of problems. So instead of spending $300 to have a tech like me come out, you could buy this for what is it, like 50 bucks on Amazon. I'll send the link. And uh, this is a really quick way to get things uh, loosened and moving again. Um, another thing is, I've had to do this for a client before, but their clog was all the way up by their toilet and we couldn't get through it with a snake or anything. So what we did was we hooked this apparatus up again, you know, hooked it up like this, the valve on the far side near the hose, and I had somebody hold the toilet open and watch the toilet water. As soon as they saw water coming into the toilet, then we released the valve. And we kept doing that until their whole system was clear. Um, helped a great deal. Uh, if you don't have a flush system on your RV, then you should definitely get something like this and just put it on, leave it on with your hose. And when you want to drain your black, just you know, drain the black, close this, fill it with water for a second, and drain it until it comes out clear. And uh, that'll be the best way to keep uh, your smell out. Um, it'll just keep things working. All your sensors, your your uh, your valves won't get all stuck up, and things will just work better and last longer. Go ahead and order this off the link on our website. You'll uh, really appreciate having it. It'll save you a lot of money in the long run. Um, I said Campco makes it. Some things I forgot to mention: we're a family of four. We full time in our RV. Um, we don't use any of the chemicals to help with smell or anything like that. We also use regular toilet paper. Um, I take care of the septic system about three to f uh, every three to four days um, using my flush technique. We don't have any smell or any issues. I've never had any major clogs. Um, you just have to make sure to keep up with it, make sure to keep flushing it and cleaning it. And I always run it. See right down here, I have my clear hose cover. Just always make sure that it runs clear and uh, everything should be fine. Just got to keep a good eye on it. Hey everybody, thanks for watching. I really appreciate you taking the time. Uh, please hit subscribe and like. If you have any questions or there's any videos that you'd like to see, please leave them in the comment section. I'll try to make the videos as fast as possible. I'm hoping to save you guys money in the long run so you don't have to have text come out and I can show up for serious problems instead of problems that could be easily fixed with you know a little bit of knowledge. So uh, just let me know what you want to see and uh, I'll try to get them out as fast as possible. Thank you.